Hello guys, good morning to each and everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Junard Smart Pantitas. And now this is the the part three of my Cheka Cheka <laughs> Cheka Minutes rather. So but before that I would like to, to say thank you to all my subscribers, viewers and supporters, friends, relatives, classmates, colleagues and friends and students. And now, so this morning, I am going to to uh, discuss or to recap um, my PE subject, which is uh, PE4. The descriptive title is Recreational Activities. And now, I would like to to instruct my students to please uh, listen very carefully to my short discussion and the answers key and the answer case of our prelim examination so our first um, our first um, questions but before that I would like to read our uh, general directions for our um, PE4 students. So write the letter with our corresponding words in answering the test questionnaire and avoid erasure. So two points each. So this is the questions and the answer case. So number one, a seat is won by reaching a score of 25. So the answer is valuable letter J so I repeat a set is won by reaching a score of 25 letter G valuable so meaning um, so meaning that is a, a part of our recreational activities is valuable so our uh, first set is 25 so kung kisa tayo mudaog niya na kisa tayo makauna o abot sa 25 mahoto siya ay mubali sa second set and another um, 25 sa anas ay kanuhang set mahoto siya automatically nga maoy mudaog and number 2 it refers to how you relate and react to factors within your environment I repeat it refers to how you relate relate and react to factors when your environment and the answer is you you is human ecolo human ecologic environment the answer is you human ecologic environment number three is going on an extended for the purpose of pleasure and exercise i repeat is going on an extended for the purpose of leisure and exercise. Letter N, hiking. Number four. Number four is, is a voluntarily participation in an activity during free and unlegated time that gives enjoyment is a voluntarily participation in an in an activity during free and obligated time that that gives enjoyment the answer is letter e recreation number five refers to how you consciously choose to live and manage your well-being i repeat refers to how you consciously choose to live and manage your well-being the answer is letter r r is lifestyle lifestyle number six the way you live your life is an everyday business it includes eating habits physical activity participations and rec recreational choice i repeat number six the way you live your life is an is an every everyday basis it includes eating habits physical activity participation and recreational choice the answer is letter d like lifestyle number seven is an activity is undertaken in a natural rural or open space outside the confines of building usually large 
learned earlier that is close to nature. I repeat, question number seven. As an activity is undertaken in a national, rural, or open space outside the confines of building, usually large land area that is close to nature. The answer is C. Outdoor recreation. So one of the examples of outdoor recreation is the hiking, walking, running. Number eight is a voluntarily participation in activity during free and obligated time that gives enjoyment. I repeat, number eight is a voluntarily participation in an activity during free time, during free rather, and obligated time that gives you, that gives enjoyment. Now answer is A, recreation. Number nine, so let us see. Um, a set is won by reaching a score of 25. I repeat question number nine. A set is won by reaching a score of 25. Ako na din na discuss and of course, nabalik na yung mga question. Letter J, valuable. Number 10, the best way of preventing illness and early death. The answer is E, lifestyle change. I repeat, question number 10. The best way of preventing illness and early death is letter A, lifestyle change. Of course, if you have a lifestyle change, say, mo monitor ni mo imong health and to avoid the mga kaunto mga food nga bawas sa imong lawas. Too much eat of uh, chicharia, uh, drink too much uh, drink of soft drinks or any kind of food that is bawal kinesya masama sobraan. Number eleven. Is an inherited trait that you got from your parents? The answer is letter S. A letter S. Genes, hereditary traits, genes. 11. Is an inherited trait that you get from your parents? Letter S. The answer. And the word is genes, hereditary traits, genes. Number 12. Is a voluntarily participation in an activity during free and obligated time that gives enjoyment. Letter A. Recreation. The yeah. Number 12 is a voluntary participation in an activity during free and obligated time that gives enjoyment. Letter A, recreation. Number 13, it refers to how you relate and react to factors within your environment. And the answer is letter U, human ecologic environment. Number 13, it refers to how you relate and react to factors within your environment. The answer is letter U, human ecologic environment. 14. Is an activity within the premises of your comfort zone at home or inside a building. Number 14. Is an activity within the premises of your comfort zone at home or inside a building. The answer is letter X, indoor recreation. 15. Refers to the external surroundings that you find yourself in at a given time. I repeat, number 15 refers to the external surroundings that you find all that you that you find yourself in at a given time. The answer is letter T. Environment, environment. Number 16. The best way of preventing illness and early death. The answer is A. Lifestyle change. Number 16, I repeat, the best way of preventing illness and early date is letter A, lifestyle change. 17, refers to how you consciously choose to live and manage your well-being. The answer is letter R, lifestyle, lifestyle. I repeat, refers to how you consciously choose to live and manage your well-being. The answer is letter R. Lifestyle, lifestyle. Number 18. Refers to the processes and structure of your body and how it performs work. The answer is letter O. Physical fitness. Your body. Letter number 18. I repeat. Refers to the processes and structure of your body and how it performs work. Letter O. Physical fitness. to Your body. Number 19. Is an al alternative indoor recreational activity with fitness benefit claims. The answer is M. Letter M. Jump, Samba Fitness Dance. So, number 19 is an alternative indoor recreational activity with fitness benefit claims. Letter M. Zumba Fitness Dance. 
Twenty refers to how you perceive and believe the existence of things in your environment. The answer is spiritual fitness. So that is your spirit. Number twenty refers to how you perceive and believe the existence of things in your environment. The answer is letter P. Spiritual fitness. Your spirit. Number twenty one is a voluntarily participation. In an activity during free and obligated time that gives enjoyment, the answer is letter A, recreational, a recreation rather. Number 21 is a voluntarily participation in an activity during free and obligated time that gives enjoyment, the answer is letter A, recreation. Test 2. Write all the letters of your answer and what is the result, so meaning to say, ang tanan man yung answer gikan sa number 1 to 21. Tanawa itong mga letters dito kung siya nahimong result sa maong mga letters. Naamay siya yung words na na-compose. And that's all the the answer cave our prelim examination, which is our PE4. I hope and then I pray nga unta um, nakamaong mo, tamoy na kuha, bisa gamay. And I will try my best to to impart my knowledge, my experience about the the our subject matter which is the recreational activity and i think next week i am going to um take the opportunity this morning uh, uh, ma -grupo mo, ma -groupings para sa ang preparation for reporting so once again thank you so much and please follow the the answer case please uh, listen very carefully and if you have any clarifications or queries just you can uh, send me a message to our GSE um, please keep safe always and God bless bye bye